Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Well, as expected, there are some snow showers around tonight, and as expected, most of these are in the higher elevations. And what we're finding here is, well, not only is the wind helping to, well, bump into the mountains, get pushed up, we've got condensing going on and some snow coming down, but the radar sometimes have a little, has a little trouble picking up on all this. Now, we are seeing the snow down toward places like a Middlebury, down toward the Middlebury Snow Bowl, Bristol over toward Warring, so that's good news for Sugarbush. Then we come to the north and Huntington, up to Bolton, some more uh, ski areas getting some snow keep coming to the north and we've got some snow coming down. But note the way it looks like snow, not much going on there, but that's actually the beam from the radar in Burlington in Colchester actually getting blocked by the mountains. And we know that because check it out. There's a webcam there that we're tapping into. Hard to see, but this is snow, the ski area right there. Visibility is not good because we've got the snow coming down. It's pretty cold too. seven degrees there west north. No, no west southwest wind now at just three miles an hour. So temperatures in the teens. We've got some 20s out there too. It's 18 Burlington, 21 Lebanon. Bennington right now is at 20 degrees. All right, in the Champlain Valley, next 12 hours, temperatures dipping down. Think it'll low tonight, eight, nine degrees or so. I think it's going to be clearer later on tonight. And that sets us up very nicely for what is coming tomorrow. We've got a ton of sunshine on the way. In fact, two sunny days are coming. It is going to be warmer into the weekend because I know today not exactly well for this time of year. It is very unseasonable. We should be talking about mid 30s. No problem. Weekend weather, by the way, kind of a half and half deal. One day looks terrific. One day does not look that great. So hang on a second. All right, so we've got a lot of sunshine tomorrow. Just a few more clouds perhaps mixing in by the afternoon. Temperatures, though, getting into the low 30s. So here's future cast. Want to take you through the overnight. Here comes a great looking Friday and a day where it's going to be real nice to be outside because it's going to be warmer and it looks like tomorrow night. No worries at all. Here comes your Saturday. This is going to be the pick of the weekend. Everybody Saturday looks to be pretty good. Saturday night things are starting to change. Check it out early on Sunday. We're being threatened with <laughs> some snow here. This is six o'clock in the morning getting into southern Vermont, northern New York and watch this. We'll take you right up to say noon on that day and there's kind of a slug of moisture we're expecting in the morning. It's going to continue to go through. It's still even East of the Champlain Valley, I think as we just start the afternoon, this then blows through. We may end the day or even the evening with a couple of raindrops here and there as temperatures actually go up, especially aloft. We're not talking about a huge storm here. One to three inches for most of us. Then in the higher elevations, the Green Mountains, parts of the Whites and also the Adirondacks, three to six, probably for most of these areas closer to three, though. OK, partly cloudy tonight and a few snow showers we're seeing low temperatures, mainly in the plus category here. Not everybody too below up in St. Johnsbury, maybe some negative numbers in the Adirondacks, too. And then for tomorrow, mostly sunny. Pick your spot in northern Vermont, northern New Hampshire, Morrisville 32, along with Burlington looking good in northern New York, Plattsburgh 34, Lake Placid at 28. And again, mostly sunny in places like Pulteney. 33 Bellows Falls at 38 degrees. 32 is going to do it for you tomorrow. Here comes your Saturday. That looks good too. With a lot of sunshine, 31. Don't forget clocks go ahead as we go uh, to daylight savings time. How about that? Now we've got snow on Sunday, maybe ending as a little bit of rain and it's going to be a windy day. Upper 30s for highs that day. Maybe a little bit of rain and snow kind of lingering on your Monday. 40 degrees. That's an early high Tuesday. Some morning snow showers. We're back into the 30s. We'll extend it out for you. Wednesday looks OK and then maybe a little rain after that because note you guys temperatures are going to be in the 40s for a bunch of days.